NWA wrestling fans, Kyle Davis here, joined in the ring by EC3 and Tom Latimer. Gentlemen, you faced each other at hard times in New Orleans. Obviously, the match got personal, to say the least. Now, Tom, I've known you for many years. I think the fans at home and everybody that does know you knows that you've evolved into the person you are today. And that match ended in a disqualification because I hate to use your phrasing, you let this man control your narrative. Now, the NWA has allowed you both to air your grievances with each other, not in the heat of competition. Tom, is there anything you need to say to this man? EC3, you can, you can talk all day long about my uh, struggles with addiction and, and my arrests and things like that. You, you can talk about my limp as much as you as much as you please however the last thing that you want to speak the last thing that you want to ever say is a bad word about my wife and the way that she feels about me this tag match whether or not i have a good or bad tag partner is indifferent fact of the matter is your ass mate is going to get kicked and he mentioned the tag match that is tonight obviously whatever you say now gentlemen is the time to get it out there. I mean, a tag match, how typical. Wrestling 101, an owner painting by numbers what they think would be good. A good guy and a bad guy who are in a feud, fight each other, but we can't quite have the payoff yet, so we make it a tag team match. Put a, put a good guy with him, put a bad guy with him. How ironic, and I wonder how this match will go. I wonder if this match will start with you and me in the ring, and I go, eh, I don't wanna fight, tag out. I wonder if this match is going to continue Continue where you get everything you want to get on me, on him. And I watch and I laugh. I wonder if that's how it's going to go because, Tom, I know how this ends. You represent every person that watches wrestling. You represent each and every person that has lived and breathed because you have pain, you have regret, you have sorrow, you've made mistakes but you've made your way out. You provide hope. You provide hope for their pain, and that is why you have to feel mine. Tom, I know how this ends. We will have our epic confrontation. We will have our one-on-one -on -one match. We will fight tooth and nail, blood, sweat, and tears like the NWA was born on. And there will be a victor. One of us will leave that ring carried, changed, gone. And the other, the other will be the future world's heavyweight champion. What more can you say, Kyle? You're right. You're right, and I can say it. I'm mad enough to say it. you are right. That's tonight, NWA Power. Week. It is rowdy, it is rocking, it is electric here in Chalmet, Louisiana. I'm Joe Galley, Tim Storm, and it's time, it's time. It's velvet time, baby. That's right, we got big <laughs> tag team action. We already saw it in that pre taped interview with Kyle Davis involving Tom Latimer and EC3, but we got a big show. Woo! Scion is taking on Thrill Billy Silas in non title action, but in our main event, Camille is taking on a hometown hero, Jasmine Allure. The Burke is on the line. Welcome to NWA Power. This is wrestling as it's meant to be. Let's get straight to the action. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you can see in the ring, Tom Latimer teaming with a hometown hero in Danny Flamingo, part of Wildcat Sports. Tom wants to get some retribution on, on EC3 after EC3's choice words. Man, he, he got extremely personal, extremely vicious. Like and week after week. Tag is made to his partner, Matt Lance. He also representing Wildcat Sports. 
Former two-time Wildcat heavyweight champion, former two-time Wildcat Revolution champion. Also a winner of the Revolution Rumble, which you'll be seeing on upcoming episodes, or I should say on an upcoming episode of NWA USA. Nice height, Latimer. Nice hip toss. Yeah. Oh, for a big, tall guy, Latimer sure gets some height on that drop kick. And look at the big old smile that was on the sure. face of EC3. I don't think he cares about his tag team partner at all, but tag is made, and this crowd. Ooh, the hometown hero. They love some Danny Flamingo. Oh, a little drop down, drop toe hold. What do we got? <laughs> There's the Flamingo. Nice. Flamingo and Matt Lancey, very familiar with each other. Been the battle over the years here. Standout athletes from Wildcat Sports. Nice arm drag by Flamingo. There's another, another one. one. Beautiful. That's why I love it when we go into partnerships with promotions like Wildcat. You get to see athletes like this one. Give them a big platform, and Flamingo is really taking advantage of that. And there you see that man on the side, hard body, hard body Harper. Oh. Manager for Matt Lancey. Oh, EC3 over here. Elbow to the back. Whew. And EC3 somehow is bleeding. Dear God. Well, it was that collision in the ring. Uh, he, wow. Danny Flamingo got on oh, a roll in there. EC3 decided he was going to put a stop to it. Uh -oh. He doesn't care. He doesn't care. Tag is made well, to I think EC3. he cares now. I think EC3's probably a little bit upset. Oh, and that blood is just pouring down the face of EC3. Putting the boots to the Flamingo. On oh, the vicious chops, too. Well, that chest is going to be bleeding if that keeps going. Ooh. Danny Flamingo known as the Chalmation sensation. We are in Chalmette, Louisiana, ladies and gentlemen. You hear the crowd saying they love him, but he's going to need that love to get through this. This is, and, and at the end of the day, we have to really wonder. I mean, what is the mindset for Tom Latimer? Does EC3 live in the mind of Tom Latimer, or is he able to resist all that? Well, good yeah. question. So, I think so far, I think he's fought a good fight. Yeah. I think he has, but. I think at this point, Tom Latimer is he's pretty much on to EC3's mind games. So I don't know if he's even into the, in the cover head, shoulders in the down, head of pick up by Flamingo. I think maybe at first, but I, I don't know. I could be wrong. I don't know. I mean, if EC3 has done nothing but play mind games with, 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 with Tom Latimer, but. How long can you. Uh, how long as Vladimir do you allow somebody like EC3 to live in your head before you just, you know, brush them off, write them off? You know, there's only so much you can take before you just say, you just brush it off. What do you think? I hope so. I, I mean, I hope, but we've, we've seen him push and push and prod and push and, and got to the point where, you know, I thought, you can't shake Tom Latimer. You can't. But then he and spoke then we about saw his him, wife. And no. then we saw him snap. He, sure. he, he found something that was sensitive enough. You bring a man's wife yep. into it, it, that's when it gets really personal. Well, he is just, he's just grinding it down right now. Vladimir is yep. laser focused. Wants to get tagged in so bad. Wants to get a piece of EC3. Flamingo fighting back, able to break it. Oh, but EC3 takes right back over. And he look, yeah. look at him. He face to face with Vladimir right now. Right. Don't pay him any attention, Tom. It's not worth it. Well, at Tom Latimer's, his response Tag was, made. shouldn't you be pinning the man right there? I mean, he's not going to let that happen, but he's... Did EC3 just lose focus? 
Maybe. That's a great point, Tim. Well, but Flamingo I fighting back. Here he comes. Gets immediately shut down with a big punch from Lancey. Scoops him up on the shoulder. Ooh, face first into the top turnbuckle. Ducks the clothesline. Oh, oh but he hits, hits it that time. Up. This could be the end here. Hooks that inside leg. Kick out by Flamingo. Stretching the pressure on the shoulders right now of Flamingo. Right now, He's stretching him out. The the crowd is 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 pulling for for Danny Flamingo, but his biggest his biggest cheerleader right now is Tom Latimer because Tom Flamingo turn he around needs turn around right tag there. you're right there tag there it is made. yeah no question on that here one. comes Latimer ducks the clothesline inverted atomic drop nice clothesline by Latimer. Oh, he's feeling it. He's feeling it. Woo. Freshest Our man in the fire. matchup. Tom Latimer. Beautiful. Oh, Latimer is fired up. He wants a piece of EC3. Oh, did you hear oh, that? Yeah. Yes, yeah, he he's did. demanding. He's demanding, He's demanding that EC3 get in. Made. Man, look at look at Tom Latimer's eyes. You talk about somebody. Maybe maybe right now. This is intense. Yeah, maybe right now he's crawling into EC3's head. You're right. Well, he, look, he, EC3 came in the ring, but he never made the tag. Yeah. He's not the legal True. man. Wait, what he in just the hit his world own man. is going on with his, right with now? With his finisher, his own partner. What was? What? Oh, he's telling Vladimir, you finish him now. Because he, he doesn't want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe yeah, with Vladimir. So. He, he's just feeding him. Lancey, oh, into that cross face. Again into the cross face. Immediate what tap out. It's EC3 over. What is do? This. The winners of this match, the team of Tom Latimer and Danny Flamingo. The sick and twisted mind of EC3. Was he this sacrificed all his partner? It for, seems for like it was all. Sorry to cut you off, Velvet. Right. It seems like it was all part of EC3's game. We have to take a. Well, oh, no, he's got hard body oh hopper. God. What is happening what is, here? He's just That's the manager. Feeding everybody the manager on his team there? to Latimer. He Look. knows Latimer is not done taking out his frustrations. Oh, hard no. Body oh, no. Into the cross face. Into the cross face. Latimer is picturing that being EC3 right now. He EC3. wanted a piece of EC3 so bad. EC3 is proving, though, that he doesn't care about anybody but himself. He can be play all the games he wants to play. But right now, he's feeding these guys to a vicious Tom Latimer. We, we got to take a break. We'll be right back. Danny Deals, what's the gig? We've got all kinds of stuff here. Unfortunately, Candy's not here, but that's okay because we've rented. We're going to have to call you Bubblegum. Look at this new hat, right? We've already had this hat. I blew it out. I had to make more, right? How about this? That's pretty sweet. You like that one? I love it. Eu acho esse chapéu são maravilhoso. Olha, eu olho bem chique. me. Look at that. Pretty sweet. And then I'll come back around this way. This is nice, too. Just got a zipper. Unzip that. Oh, that's a cool shirt. Look at that shirt right there. Yeah, that's almost sold out because that's the Deal Man shirt. That's right. It's the Old Begotten shirt. Look at this. Ah, uh, new hoodie. It's getting cold outside. I'm going to cover my ears up. Huh? Who else is going to do that for you? Hey, tell them, what, tell them where they can get it at, Bubblegum. Você pode achar todas essas coisas no NWA Merchandise. Welcome to Macrovia Dojo. Today, we learn karate! Karate! Hyo! Very good! Number one, you step forward. Today, you learn basic strike. From the stomach. You understand? Yes. Show me. Very good, number one. 
Number two, step forward. Today, you learn double strike from the stomach. Stomach. matchup as part of our Revolution Rumble Power Trip. The Wildcat Revolution Championship on the line. Chuck Devine holding the championship. You see him on the right side of your screen. And the challenger, Nate Bradley. For Nate Bradley, this will be his first title shot in Wildcat. After spending years wrestling here, he's finally getting a shot at a title. What would it mean Revolution to Revolution Championship. Actually... It's got to be huge. In front of this whole crowd. Yeah, yeah what, right? What a great venue. Tonight. What a great crowd. What a, what a great place to get your first your first shot. And fans of Wildcat Sports know that there's a, a lot of heat between these two, but they've never had a one-on-one -on -one contest. We're going to find out who the better man is and who's going to be walking out the Revolution Champion. Divine with the early advantage and also the size advantage in this. Well, he, sh he is showing, and, and he's a champion. He's showing some intensity Ooh, there. But Bradley's got the the quickness the, the, to his advantage. My goodness! National Wrestling Beautiful Alliance strives to be the home. By Bradley. Oh, into the cover, shoulders down. What an athlete! Bradley is quick. Yeah, yeah the NWA strives to be the home for new young talent. And these guys are hungry, and what an opportunity they have right now on this episode of Power. Running kick to the face in the corner. Yeah, that, that's, a, that's a nice follow-up. You know, so many times we see somebody... Nice suplex. Oh. Now he hangs on to it. Oh, but Divine fights back. Fisherman. Oh, wow. Delivers a fisherman suplex on Bradley. That was almost like a fisherman brain buster. Yeah, landed high on the back, on the yeah. back of the neck. Yes, Kick out. Did. I mean, Chuck Devine, I mean, he's never met a rule that he wouldn't be afraid to bend or break, but. And this and this is, this is good strategy on his part. He's going to slow it down a little bit. He's going to take some of that speed away. Because it, if Bradley takes over again, it's going to be a... Faster paced match like we, we saw a little bit earlier. And Chuck well, Devine won that Revolution Championship. He won it in a fatal four way matchup, which Chase Valor was a part of. He's along got him along in with Ed now. Stone. I like this. I like this strategy. I mean, there's no way. Oh, where's there's, he, where's there's Bradley no way going? Dave, Nathan Bradley where's can, he going? How's he, well, he getting out of this? Well, there's no way he can fly around if he's grounded like that, if he can take some of that air out of his lungs. And, and notice how he's leaning into, on his, on his right thigh, he's leaning in and kind of, oh. Ooh, nice. That's a counter, you beautiful gotta counter. You got to do to get out of this. Trying to bridge up. Got it. Nate Bradley going to work. Good exchange there. Scoops him up, big body slam. Driving the oxygen out of him. And again, now targeting that head and neck area. Nathan Bradley is, is I mean, you can tell he's, he's, a, he's a fighter. You know, when we knew we were going to do a partnership with Wildcat, oh, we were going to see some incredible athletes that have been featured on this promotion. We're always looking. For the best and the brightest. Wildcat, Wildcat uh, has been an incredible promotion. What, it was 11 years is, is yeah. the anniversary. And, and they've, they've produced some, some outstanding talent. These two guys are putting on, a, putting on a show right now. 
You know, when I said best and the brightest, you could also just put the most intense and Absolutely. the most aggressive, because that's what we're seeing in this matchup. He's got Divine now in a full Nelson. Standing switch. You said earlier Divine had a size advantage, and he, sh uh, he showed it right there. Just, just powered his way out of it. Roll up. Roll through. Oh, <laughs> double stop to the chest of the champ. Standing Beautiful. shooting star, Beautiful. or the moonsault, I should say. Oh, so close. He's got to follow that up now. Oh, oh Divine wow. driving that, the face of Bradley right down hard on the mat. Look, that wasn't pretty, but it certainly did the job. Oof. Well, and, and, it, and it shows why, he, why he's been champion. You know, he, he's got the experience there where he knows he can. Can't he waste can, any yeah. time here, though, Divine. And that's what happens when you do a good call. Bradley not giving up this wow. one. Beautiful! Oh that my gosh, jumping Nate Bradley. Hurricane Rana. What an athlete. From the floor. A thing of beauty. What and Nate Bradley next. springboard into the drop kick. Wow, so impressed by Nathan Bradley. Caught him solid in the jaw. Standing shooting Just star. Beautiful. Cover into the, the cover. Champ. Oh, Kick so out. close. He is, he had, he's hit some huge moves, and the champ just keeps kicking out. Yeah, Nate Bradley, I mean, he is, one word to describe him would be explosive. Yeah. Back into the full Nelson. Looking for that DDT. Nathan Bradley trying to power up. His way out of it, was able to do it. Fans of Wildcat Sports know that Chuck Devine likes to use that DDT as a finishing maneuver, but a roll-up kick out. Oh. And a clubbing blow to the back. One oh, there it is. Oh, my God, did he oh spike him? Oh, my gosh. He spiked him. Yeah, there's that no looked way. vicious. Champ retains. Wow. The winner of this match, and still Wildcat Sports Revolution Champion, Chuck Devine. Chuck Devine gets the win, but what a showing that was for Nate Bradley. Congra congratulations, Chuck. May Valentine, she's backstage with Pope and JTG. Pope, JTG, what a beautiful yet unexpected pairing at Hard Times 3 as you helped Team Mayweather defeat Jack Stane. Yes, I did. I had to help Team Mayweather. Me and the Pope got, uh, go back, way back. We got a lot of history, and he helped me out when I was uh, starting off. You know, he had my back when I needed a place to stay, when I was hungry, and uh, at hard times, you know, I definitely had to pay the Pope back. Pope? And you know, when it comes to Pope and Mayweather, uh, we go way back. So I wash his back. My boy got my back, JTG, that is. And then, of course, Pope has your back. Hell, Pope has his own back. But the one thing you know, whether you need some star power, some entertainment, or just a good push for it, you know you can call on Pope. But tonight, or whenever I get in that ring with gags the gimps, Pope don't do no gimps and Pope don't do no gags, but when it comes to Pope and JTG, we like to do some ragging and we're definitely going to be doing some tags. Yeah. On Saturday's NWA USA, you'll be against Gags the Gimp and Jadias. Thank you, guys. Talk is on a favorite pitch. Austin Ireland, the headlines all over again. He's on NWA Fight TV pay-per-view. He's on NWA Power on the Fight TV network all around the globe. Austin Ireland is still, has always been, always will be a big deal, a driving force in professional wrestling. And you want to be part of this business. You want to be standing here like the idol. You want to be standing here like next to the idol? How would you like to be on NWA Power, on Fight TV? You know it's possible. Anything is possible. Your impossible dream is possible. But there's one thing you got to do, darling. You got to get the right training from the right guy 
at the right place and you're looking at him. Austin Idol's Universal Wrestling College in Greenville, South Carolina, man. You go to that website and sign up. I will take you under my wing. I will teach you. I will coach you. I will show you all the ins, the outs, the ups and downs, and how to make you successful, <laughs> just like me. The one and only Universal Heartthrob, Austin Island. UniversalWrestlingCollege.com. UniversalWrestlingCollege.com. Go there. The following non-title match is one fall with a 15-minute time limit. Introducing first, from Blount County, Tennessee, this is Thrillbilly, Silas Mason! Non-title or not, you know Thrillbilly's gonna bring the fight. He looks serious and ready to Woo. go. Oh my goodness. Ah. Woo. He is the NWA, a national heavyweight champion. This is the Great Scion. The Great Scion. That national heavyweight championship around his waist. But it is not on the line tonight. Do you think that changes anything in the strategy for Scion going into a match against the Thrill Billy Silas Mason? It better not. I, I think that everything, uh, still talking. Austin Idol, still Austin talking. Austin Idol, my goodness. I, I don't want to know, but I bet money he talks in his sleep. I don't think that I don't I don't think that it, that that he can approach any match with without the same intensity. It carries over to your next match and the next match. Oh sure. I think yes. he's as a champion. You never want to lose in any situation. No matter what. I, but look, you know, look, look who he's across the ring from. Last time we saw Silas Mason in action was at Hard Times 3. In an unscheduled matchup, he got a big victory over Odinson. You'd have to think that if he is victorious, he would get a rematch for that national championship. Real Billy, really big, strong, intense. But here's the thing, once again, the love of his life and his manager, Poyo Del Mar, having travel issues, from what I understand, coming back internationally, stuck in customs, had way too many bags. Each yes. one of those bags weighing over 200 pounds. I have no idea what the fees would be for that, though. Yeah, I know. Bit. You're missed, Poyo. We miss you. And I think no one misses Poyo more than Thrillbilly Silas Mason, but, but I think perhaps. that's why he's so angry. He yeah, I think that's love. why. Intense. Well, maybe he's channeling all that rage. You know, he, he misses Poyo. It's Poyo's this such an important true. part of his life. This is true. I mean, and now he's, he's always there in the corner supporting her man. Yes. Well, he's one and he's one and zero, right? I mean, it, yeah. He won the and, last and, match. And maybe he's there. got a lot of pent up energy and rage that they, he's just going <laughs> to unleash <laughs> oh, on Zion. <laughs> it's science. <laughs> Terrified. Sure. Jeez. Collar elbow tie oh, up is Silas Mason. Using his size advantage, but look at the strikes oh my gosh, from the great sound. Just a freight train. Rocks the champ with that. The pressure's always on when you're a champion, but when you're part of a group where you're one of three champions, I mean, it, it, you can't lose matches. No, you no, can't. No. You gotta keep the gold within the group. Well, he was the he was the first of that to win the gold. He definitely doesn't win to be the first one to lose oh it. Oh my goodness. Slingshot off that top rope. He had to do it. It's signed. Fistful of hair. Of hair, yes. And you could tell that just from the body language of Austin Idol, that was definitely something out of his playbook. Well, and we've, we've seen Scion successful against different types of wrestlers, size differentials. We've seen him. We've seen him be a technical wrestler. We've seen him be a power. We've sure. seen him in a hardcore match. Yeah, a little bit of everything. Yeah, there, there's. I don't think there's any challenge he that, that he hasn't so far stepped up to. Tonight's uh, Ooh, obviously that a vicious bitch. back rake. Is he biting him? Absolutely, he is cutting any corner he can. 
scratching and clawing to get that advantage over the larger Thrillbilly Silas Mason. And I think that answers, that answers your mirror. question earlier, Joe. You know, Stiff I think kick the, to the back. Does My he, goodness, Does he Zion. approach this differently? Well, we just saw him. What? Oh, look, look he's at standing that. on the hair. This is a really sadistic side, just like you were saying, Velvet. A very sadistic side. Oh, sure. Zion. You never know what side of Zion you're going to see until well, with you're all seeing it before your dad. eyes. Yeah, I know, right? You, you know, yeah, I'm cross so sorry, face. Zion. I'm so sorry for that. But, you know, well, and, and, it's different. Different and denying that for so long. I mean, it's got to have issues. What do you think that's issues. done to Sion? Like his emotional, his mental and emotional state of being, you know, being denied so many years of his his life. And, and now just to find out this is his father, like how does one just get over that? Do you get over that? Or, exactly. Maybe you embrace it. He's embracing the moment. Well, I think he's tried. I think both have tried to, to, to convince us that they've embraced it. But but we see but right now really? you're seeing a sick and twisted side that, and 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 maybe, you know, when I when I say different styles, maybe he just recognizes that this is what he has to do to win. Maybe against a guy this size, this strong, maybe that's what he has to do. But do you think he feels he still has a lot to prove to his father, Austin Idol? Oh. I don't think he'll ever be able to prove enough to Austin Idol. I think he will spend the rest of his life trying. But why do you think that? Wouldn't you think it would be the other way around? Wouldn't you think Austin Idol would want to prove himself to his son after denying him for most of his life? But I don't think you can deny your son for that long and be thinking reasonably. I think. I Good think point. That, and we are talking about Austin Idol, so. Well, he was the first to hold that, you know, to hold the title, and and I don't. Do you ever surpass that? Man. For science' sake, I, I sure hope so. You can see the handprint on the side of, oh, wow, my God, yeah. the left side of Sion's yeah. body. It's incredible, the power and the strength of Silas Mason. And Silas Mason never needed to be fingerprinted. Just bring Sion in for, <laughs> my goodness, his whole hand is on the left side of Sion's body. Sion rushed in but eats a back elbow. And Silas oh Mason, my gosh. the momentum is shifting for the Thrill Billy. Scoops him up, slams him down hard. Oof. Sion looks like he's in a little bit of trouble here. Well, you, you get that freight train moving. It, it, it's hard to stop. He's got momentum right now. Scoops him up again. Looking for a power slam, perhaps. No. Sends Sion into that top turnbuckle. Plants him in the corner. Full head of steam. Runs into the boot. Gets the boot up. Sion with double leg legs. sweep. Shoulders down outside the ropes. He's on the ropes. The referee didn't see it. The winner of this match, oh. the great Sion. Referee did not see it. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Allowing Sion, Sion to retain like you were that saying, championship. Tim, like you were saying, he could feel that brake train was starting to move. He had to cut a big corner, put his feet on the ropes, get that leverage for the win. Oh and my gosh, and you can see Thrill Billy is just. You'd have to think if Pollo Del Mar was here, we might not have seen that outcome. Well, or we might have seen him. Somebody's got to calm him down right now. Look, look at his eyes. Oh my God, he's full of reach. Oh my, oh my. Lord. Back to your point, Joe. He may explode at any minute. Yeah, he could. Poyo, please, please come back soon, Poyo, please. Yeah, absolutely. But I'm hearing in my ear, May Valentine, she's standing by with Ella Envy. May, take it away. Please welcome NWA World's Women Tag Team Champions, Pretty Empowered. Ladies, <laughs> congratulations on your big win at Hard Times 3. But what I am interested in knowing is about this upcoming match against Natalia Markova and why is Kenzie Page going to be the special guest referee. Okay, um, first off, May, I know you didn't have many friends growing up and you probably just sit at home on a Saturday night with all of your cats and two Jimmy John's pizzas or sandwiches, whatever they have. <laughs> but Kinsey is my best friend in the whole world and my tag partner, let's not forget that or these, okay? So, of course, she's gonna be involved. So, I don't really know what else you expected. <laughs> Kenzie, how can you be impartial when you are her best friend? I'm sorry. Did did you hear that? Are you accusing me of cheating right now? Are you assuming that I'm gonna cheat? You know what? You know, Ella, did you talk to my ex-boyfriend? Did you talk to Oh my wow, and the truth be told, the truth be told. No, I'm not gonna cheat. I'm gonna be, you know, good and just call it right down the middle, like every other NWA ref. All right, now get it. Okay, okay. Also. I don't need 
anybody to cheat for me. I am a champion. Unlike you, you might want to get a belt, just saying. So, and for Natalia Markova, <laughs> you saw what we did to Maddie and Missa at hard times. <laughs> we gave them the hardest time of their freaking lives. I'm a champion for a reason, honey. So get ready. <laughs> okay, get that out of my face. Your hand smells for real. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Okay, bye, bye, bye. Thanks. 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 Hey, what's the gig? Danny Deals, Daniel W Deals, Triple D, the Deal Machine, whatever you want to say. Not at the Deals house, but hanging out with the lovely bubble gum, holding the place for candy, came right off the bench. It's wonderful. NWA USA, the Deal Man Show, huh? Look at that, pretty sweet. That's a new color. I like the green. You like the green? I love the green. Everybody knows I hate this little punk, but I'll make a deal with anybody. Oh, Deals, my boy, Gimp needs a t shirt. And so he's got a t shirt. It's terrible, but it's almost gone. The orange shirt, it's one of you like it too, don't you? Ah, nice pink t shirt. I like the pink it pops really on me what do you think i think it's lovely yes i do tire stop smashing everything that's right old tyranius rex he's the new champion we got a shirt for him i have to keep reprinting this because i can't heed the stock everybody loves it this is the deal man said you love these colors too that's a great color scheme isn't it Ta-da! right uh, now who wouldn't want this you see this you see this you want this in real life you buy it on here and then you just imagine gray and white logo this is a wonderful t-shirt don't you think so tootsie pop all right oh, nationalizing you hit the shop button and you know it's e para pegar todas as suas coisas hoje no shop nationalwrestlingalliance.com e só toca naquele link merchandise. Yes! I think the last thing, I, I know this crowd is... Oh, is, my gosh. Oh, my gosh, homicide. Just unleashing. Oh, there it is. There it is. He pushed it too and far. That's what you have to do. Well, man, I, bet, I know Wait this minute, crowd. Wait a minute, Homicide just got has disqualified Homicide. Uh-oh. The winner of this match, by disqualification, Jace Valor. Guys, guys, wait, wait. Homicide had no idea he was disqualified. Uh, hey, come on, man. I, I don't know I, what he is capable of I, right I, now. I, this I don't is know, but like, like, oh, no, 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 homicide. No, 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 don't you do it. Oh, my gosh. Uh-oh. Oh, uh -oh. oh no, uh -oh. no, 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 homicide. No. The following match is one fall with a 20-minute time limit. It is for the NWA World Women's Championship. Introducing first, the challenger from Orlando, Florida. This is top tier Jasmine Allure. You know, Jasmine Allure has so much promise in the world of wrestling. Just 22 years old, and I mean, just skyrocketing his career. And Velvet, this is a debut for her in the National Wrestling Alliance, but she's no stranger to a wildcat ring. It was just a few months back that she went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Serena Deeb Ooh, yeah. and really took Serena Deeb to the limit. And that really says something about this young woman. She looks great, too. Incredible shape. Beautiful girl. I'm, I'm sure I, I full All respect. Smiles until. Full respect with, against Serena Deep. But this is a whole different, Oof, this is a whole sure different situation. Is. This is the one time. One time. Let's go one time. And her opponent from Durham, North Carolina. She is the NWA World Women's Champion. This is the Brick House. Camille! I mean, Camille just a few weeks back had that incredible showing at Hard Times 3, defending that championship against Kylan King and Chelsea Green. I mean, it, it's, it's hard to think anybody could stop Camille, but you have to think, just like in anything, in the sport of professional wrestling, it takes just three seconds. Just three seconds, and Jasmine Allure could make history here tonight. You know, you know there's no no place she'd rather do it than in front of home. Yeah, than home sure. in front of this crowd. And sometimes that can get, just get that little bit of extra motivation that you need. The one, one finger time. for the one time. That's right, Velvet. Camille's presence that. is just, it just goes unmatched to anybody. But I the just... smile on the face of Jasmine or Lore. Let's go 
I mean, you she's think showing it's a nervous smile, an excited I, I don't know. smile, a you, devious smile. What do you think? Just to give folks at home an idea of the dedication that Jasmine Lore takes to the sport of professional wrestling. She went out of her way, traveled hundreds of miles, moved her entire life to get trained by the best. And that's two former NWA World Women's Champions and Thunder Rosa and Jazz also trained by Rodney Mack as well. And uh, in, in just a very short time, I mean, it's a lot talk of heart, about dedication, it determination, is, it is. And, sacrifice. And not is, only that, you know what, I've, I've been part of those training seminars as well, and she's a real natural. But you could see Camille with just the size oh advantage gosh, the in this size, matchup. Oh, my the strength. But that may also give you give, give us the, uh, the answer to was she afraid, was she excited. If that's who you, who you were trained by, you're probably not afraid of anybody. You would have to think that Jasmine Allure has to come in with a strategy to rely on some speed and quickness. Comes off the ropes, but runs Man. into the shoulder. She's got to find her opening, her spot, her groove. Got to feel it out with the champ at first. and Going after the arm. All, All right. right. There's okay, the, Jasmine. And there's the speed you talked about. Trying the power's to shoot not going to work. champ off, but she's got that waist lock. But she Camille learned her. Reverses. She learned her lesson on that 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 huge shoulder. You don't. Oh, but look hit at that! that the agility tried to pick the ankles. Trying to take the oh. champ off her feet. Trying to oh, arm drag oh, Camille. Not happening. Oh, she's got her rolled up. School go into a one count. Traps the arm. Rolls through. Shoulders down. Kick out. One count again. So Jasmine trying to break Camille down, but it's going to take more than a couple arm strikes. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, she got caught. Transitioned into that head scissors. Don't waste time, girl. You got to go. You got to go. Flies in with the back elbow. Shoot, reverse. Kick to the midsection. Solid kick. To, yeah, solid kick. Jasmine looking for something big here, flying through the air. Oh, oh Camille, Camille put a stop oh, wow. to it. Did she Gets her up, powers her Oh up. my God, look at the power. Oh my gosh. Look at the strength. Oh. by Camille. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Jasmine Allure's little body. Kick oh, out. she kicked out. That's right. They, that shows courage. That shows some guts right there. That was huge. I'm surprised she's conscious yeah, after that. That was a huge power. Oh, she's bomb. in a lot of pain for sure. Oh, no doubt. And now the gut wrench. And this match is slowed down to that methodical pace that Camille loves. One big move after the other. Just breaking her down, move by move. And you can see it start to set in. Cover hooks that outside leg kick out by Jasmine. Yeah, ja Jas Jasmine is reaching back there, trying to trying to get a little relief from that pain. See the look at Jasmine's face, the pain I mean, that she's in right now, uh, suffering. Of course, from, I mean, just look at the arms, yeah. look at the strength that you get with Camille. If she's going to apply that pressure to her neck, it's going to do so much damage in a short amount of time. But And the knee lift. But one of the things is, as, as our NWA women's champion, every single opponent that Camille faced, you, she knows she's going to get the absolute best that they can bring. And, and we. We talked about our women's division and how strong it is. We've got powerhouses. Jasmine oh, Allure has across the chest. Mm. I, I think that's just Camille sending a message to Jasmine. I don't think she intended to, to end the match there, but oh, could be setting her up for another power bomb. Man, if she hits another one. Uh. Oh, oh my God! Oh, 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 came down. I think hard. she got whiplash on that landing. Kick out! Wow! Able to kick out that's of that. Impressive. I mean, props to Jasmine Allure, man. They're <laughs> hanging in there with Camille. Sent to the corner. Splash by the brick house. Able to move oh. out of the way. Using that agility up to the top rope again. She's got to time. get you something. Go. Oh, oh, Camille, go. Oh, oh, oh my God, sends her down. She's caught and slammed down. It's like Jasmine went for that crossbody, yeah. but Camille caught her, slammed her down hard. That was great awareness by Camille. All she had to do was swivel her hips sure. and transition that momentum. Well, Jasmine's got to get something going if, if she's going to come she's out of this. She's been trying. Yeah, she has, but, I mean, she's in there with the world's champion. It's it, You can't continue to take that much damage to your body. 
and know that it's going to sure. function. Yeah. Camille now, perhaps looking for a superplex. Jasmine trying to stop it. Maybe Ooh. able to push her off. Camille coming down on her feet. Jasmine flying back elbow. I think that took everything Jasmine had I, left. I, I don't know how she capitalizes at this point, but. I mean, she hit her with that flying elbow, but she also landed hard as a result oh, of that, yeah. so. Yeah, but it, it looks like Camille may have, may have banged up her like, shoulder there. I can't tell, but she's, you see her massaging it, trying to get a little yeah. feeling back. And... Yeah, and, and that's, that's that right shoulder, the shoulder that Camille leads with, with the spear, jawbreaker by Jasmine Allure. Kick to the chest. Another kick. This may be her chance. Oh, by she's some strikes. Yes. She's gonna have to go get this if she has if she wants to win this, she needs to do it now. Allure full head of steam. Oh, but Camille puts her Sends out onto the, the apron. apron. Yeah. Jasmine coming into the ropes. Oh. By Miner. Shoulders down, kick out. That was close. Ooh, that, wow, was that was close. Oof. Jasmine knows it too. I know she's feeling, I know she's in pain right now, but she's got to, she's got to keep going right now. She's got to follow that up to something. Looking for a suplex. I think that was a bad idea. Uh -oh. oh my goodness. Samoan drop leveling Jasmine Allure. And the kip up from the champ this late in the match. Ooh, Camille is so impressive. Every time I see her, I'm just All more and athlete. more impressed. Absolutely. Loads her up. We've seen this into the top buckle. Looking for the slam, Jasmine Lore slides out the back, backstabber, oh backstabber. Is this it? Can she, if could she, she can cover, cover she can cover. Oh. oh my gosh. Two close wow. attempts, pin attempts by this, Jasmine this, Lore now. This crowd here in the Big Easy, they got on the edge of their seat for that one. Hands on her feet. Oh, oh good <laughs> oh, wow. nice. I'm just decapitated her. Oh my gosh. She could hit it again. She's looking for that power slam she was trying to get earlier, but look at the arm of Jasmine Lore. She is lifeless. She sure is. She, uh, she's taken a lot of lot of damage, a lot. Oh, but a transition. Wait she transitioned. Oh she my reversed gosh. transition. Beautiful counter. Jasmine Lord knows she, she's got to do something more. She's got to do something big. You got to go quick. The Burke is in the balance. Jasmine Allure looking Grab to make history. You take that's just giving the champ time to recover. You gotta go, Jasmine. I know you're a little banged up. up. On the top go, go, rope. go. Oh, and she oh, moves she... out of the way. Jasmine misses with the oh, spare. 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 That is it. Champ retains. The winner of this match and still NWA World Women's Champion and the Brick House, Camille. What an incredible athlete. Jasmine Allure is taking Camille to the limit. But Camille just one time, one time. Jasmine Allure is going to come back and watch this match. She's going to be disappointed that she but lost. But she should be very proud of the, she's gonna of the, be, of the she's match. She's going to be proud. Absolutely. Congratulations, Camille. Thanks for watching NWA Power World back this Saturday with NWA USA.